60% of the time, it works every time. I mean, I mean, I mean, you know what I mean. You know what I say. You know what I mean. Pride only hurts. It never helps. That's pride fucking with you. opgevangen en uh... Obey God? We're not doing it for God. I mean, that's one way to look at it. We're doing it for ourselves. Because God takes pleasure when we're happy. That's the thing that gives Him the greatest joy this morning. So I want you to know this morning, just do good for your own self. Do good because God wants you to be happy. When you come to church, when you worship Him, you're not doing it for God, really. You're doing it for yourself. Because that's what makes God happy. Amen. Let's open our heart to Him today. Gray and Avender Gray are going to be your pastors. And I really believe that John and Avender have always been anointed. But the anointing that is going to fall on them now that they're senior pastors is going to do amazing damage to the kingdom of God. Amazing damage. Amazing damage. Amazing damage to the kingdom of God. So I'm excited about that. Don't count. You either believe in Christ or you don't. If you believe in Christ, you are, you are going to heaven, and if you yeah. don't, no matter what you've done in your life, yeah. you ain't. Yeah, it's, I don't know, it's, there's probably a, a balance between, I believe you have to know Christ, but I think that if you know Christ, if you're a believer in God, you're going to have some good works. And I think it's a cop-out to say, well, I'm a Christian, but I don't ever do anything to well, help What anybody. if you're Jewish or Muslim and you don't accept Christ at all? You know, I, I just, I'm very careful about saying who and would and wouldn't go to heaven. I don't know. I think only God. you believe you have to believe in Christ. I so believe they're, they're wrong, aren't they? Well, people? I don't know if I believe they're wrong. I believe here's what the Bible teaches. And from the Christian faith, this is what I believe. But I just think that only God can judge a person's heart. I've spent a lot of time in India with my father. And, uh, you know, I don't know all about their religion. But I know they love God. And I don't know. I'd have to, you know, I've seen their sincerity. So